Let's now uh, take you to Assam now, where it is time for the revered Ambubachi festival, which is held every year on the top of the Nilachal Hills. Kamakya Temple in Assam's Guwahati is once again abuzz with the footfall of lakhs of visitors. It's time for the Ambabuchi Mela, the biggest religious congregation of Eastern India held every year. This time, over 25 lakh people are expected. For the first three days, the temple's main door remains closed, as it is believed that during this period, the Mother Earth experiences the annual cycle of menstruation. Not only sadhvis and sadhus, but devotees across the country make a beeline. Next time we came here, we had to do it in our own way, so we had to do it in our own way. Kamakya is seen as the most sacred seed of the Shakti cult and where occults are also practiced. Now the center and state have joined hands to rebrand Ambabuchi Mela as one of India's enchanting destinations for religious tourism. Last two years, we are promoting uh, our tourism sector in entire world because we have some uh, campaigning in national market also, international market also. And we have already engaged Priyanka Supra as a brand ambassador. Kamakhen now also has more foreign visitors than before. From Western perspective, India is known that the women has, um, like have, are not equal to men. So I'm very happy seeing like some traditional event which um, brings up more the, um, the value of women. While the government wants to hard sell the mysticism around menstruation of the goddess, for the sadhus it's about praying for the fertility of the earth. For centuries, the Ambavachi Mela at the Kamakya Temple is a unique religious festival where thousands of devotees come to celebrate what is believed to be the annual menstruation of Mother Earth. And now Assam government has pitched this festival as a signature event of the state, thereby looking for more global tourists who believe in religious tourism. In Gohati, with Nakul Rabha, Ratnadeep Chaudhary, Pindi TV.